Facebook friends and family. Um, I haven't been on for a while. Did you miss me? I've been, you know, acclimating. Um, I am on day 18, so I passed the two-week mark. Tomorrow I go see my dentist. Um, I've told most of my family members I've been out in public. I've just been doing life. Um, I received a lot of orders for my food, so I've been doing that. I've been getting ready for Christmas. So my schedule with being on YouTube has been sporadic. I'm sorry I've been neglecting you guys. You know, um, my schedule will be more um, consistent after the holidays. You know, uh, the, I have these bags because I'm... I'm filling orders. I crochet, I bead, I cook, you know, I do arts and crafts, you know, I keep my son busy. He's sleeping, so when he's sleeping, it's easy to do the videos. But, um, I've been healing really well. You can't really see because of the lighting and stuff. But I've been healing really well. Um, I still have, when I press, I still have some, some sore spots. But it's been really, really good. I, I'm done with the antibiotics. I still do the warm water with salt. You know, I still do that, but I'm doing it more so like when I first wake up in the morning and after I eat. Because even though he put stitches, I could feel like a line, like there's a line going across the bottom and the top. And as I'm eating food, some of it gets caught up in there, I guess, because it's not fully closed. But, um, I do the warm water with salt just to wash it out. Um, they, they, they gave me this mouthwash and I'm supposed to only use it at night. But I've been using it when I, you know, after I do the warm salt water. I take their mouthwash and I rinse it off only because it makes my mouth feel cleaner. I haven't really done anything to my gums as of right now. Um, because now, now that I'm on day 18, now, or should I say after the two weeks, 14 days to the 18th day, or whatever, now I feel more comfortable touching my gums. You know, before I didn't feel comfortable, I didn't want to put my fingers in my mouth, I didn't want to touch it, you know, because it still felt like, well, it is an open wound, but it still felt that way. Um, I see my mom on Wednesday, so where I am right now, it's um, Monday. So I see my mom in two days. She she will see me. She didn't even you know. I think she just found out today through my aunt that I had the procedure done. So I'm going to go visit her because she's not feeling too well. But it is what it is. You know, my aunt was supposed to get this procedure done. And she was like, you're bolder than I am. You know, my fear is keeping me away from getting it done. So anytime she has a problem with a tooth, she pulls one at a time, one at a time, one at a time. She's, she's pushing off and I told her just it doesn't really hurt it's just a, like the first four days I would say the first week is like the adjustment week you know you, you like right now I feel like you know I'm missing hung, biting on a piece of bacon or eating some chips and you know uh, just having a salad like a real salad I used to love salad but it'll come, it'll come, that time will come, you know, especially when I get the permanence. I'm thinking, well, I'm going to learn to eat with those and I will be eating the foods that I can't munch on with my gums because I will be training my gums to eat. But, you know, that's my update. Um, I still have a lot of work to do, so I just wanted to jump on real quick because I didn't want to go on too many days without saying anything. I will put on, you know, some of the foods that I'm eating. I just have to prep the whole thing, like set up the camera in the kitchen and, you know, let that roll and the the massages that I've been doing, you know, because I've been having concerns about, you know, how everything changes when you don't have teeth. Everything changes. It really does. You know, I, I can feel the difference. But, um, right if you're doing this it is what it is you know it's you have to keep living you have to keep going you got to do what you got to do you have to what is it that the marines say you have to adapt adjust 
and something else. You know, I forgot their motto, but you know, it's something along those those lines. You have to adapt and adjust. You have to. Well, for those that don't, you'll be sitting in depression and you'll be, you know, wallowing in anger or sadness for no longer having feet. I won't be one of those people. You have to adapt and adjust. Um, I hope that you have a good night. Um, thank you for being a subscriber. You know, you're part of my family. That means that you're watching me on this journey, you're coming along with me. But, um,. You guys got my word. After the holidays, my, you know, my videos will be consistent. Probably on Tuesdays and Thursdays. You know, I'll be posting and I'll figure out what time. You know, because as my numbers increase with subscribers, I guess I can go on live. So, if anybody's on with me live, I can chit-chat back and forth instead of, you know, responding a day later or two weeks later. But, you know, I'm, I'm new to this. So, you know, I really appreciate you coming along on this journey with me. You know, um, teaching this newbie, giving me feedback and advice, which is also great and awesome. Um, my email is for the brand new me at Gmail. Cause some, uh, some have asked me for the email. That's the, that's the email that I have for my channel. And there'll be other things, you know, on this channel too, because if it's not one thing, it's something else. And if you do one thing, another thing pops up. Like, you know, um, I've been having issues, I guess it's called the sciatic nerve. I'm not sure, because I've never really paid attention. But it starts on the left side, and I'm like, oh, you know, I feel a little stiff. And I refuse to believe that, oh, it's because, you know, I'm aging. Not that I have a problem with that. Because I haven't, you know, I don't color my hair either. So I want to see how the glitter comes in. But, you know, it's like one thing or another. And I think I have um, on my right foot plantar fasciitis, or fasciitis or whatever it's called. I'm not sure. This is all me um, doing research and figuring these things out myself to do exercises to alleviate the pains and stuff. But, you know, as you go along with me on this journey, I'll be posting other things too as you know excuse me I was cleaning today so everything is dusty you know I feel like it's all stuck in my nose so I've been dusting and cleaning and preparing you know because the holidays are something I enjoy doing I'm just where I am in this you know like my channel is for brand new me I am becoming more consistent and purposeful in the things that I'm doing, you know, from my personal to my business and to where I, I want to be as I age, you know, as I grow in wisdom. So I'm, I'm looking forward to, you know, the new year coming and things changing little by little and my business growing and just me getting to be more comfortable in my skin, you know, and with whatever life presents to me. I gotta go because I, um, um, I still have to be up for a couple of hours and I have that uh, dentist appointment so I'll, I'll probably post tomorrow too, let you know how the, the visit went. Um, I don't, this is a thing too because when I don't have enough subscribers to go live, I don't know um, about videoing, you know, I'll have to talk to him today about videoing, you know, my, my visits and see and see how that goes. But if not, I'll definitely do a video on the post visit. Have a good night, guys. Thank you so much. And please, you know, feel free to comment. I know some of you do, so I appreciate it. It gets me excited when I see a little message thing that someone left me a message for me to respond. And I know a couple of you that I have spoken to are getting this procedure done at the end of the month. So keep me posted as to... um what's going on with you bye friends and family trust me I appreciate you going along on this journey with me it's it's exciting for me too I just have to get more consistent with the videoing and you know documenting this as it goes good night